Hi, this is Oak Tree, and in this video I'm going to show you how I got almost four pounds of plums into this jar. Hi, this is Oak Tree, Georgia, and today I'm doing plums. I'm going to dehydrate some plums up. I got almost four pounds at Walmart. They were 98 cents um, a pound, so I wanted to do some up. Um, I love plums, and I figured this would be the best way to have them in the wintertime. Um, I've never done this before, so it's a learning experience, so I thought I'd share it with you. All I'm doing is slicing my plum um, in half. I'm quartering it. I'm not going to blanch this. Um, I've read different things on how to do it, so I'm just going to try to figure it out on my own. I'm going to go ahead and get the pit out. And some of these are kind of juicy, so the pit doesn't really want to remove. But I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to try to remove the pit the best I can. And, yeah, this one doesn't want to come out. Okay, once what I do is anyways, I take and I, cut, and I quarter these right here, and then I go ahead and put them on my tray, and I am going to spray them down with lemon juice. Now, I don't know if you have to or not, but I'm going to. It can't hurt. You don't have any flavor or taste. I figured this is going to take at least mm, probably 30 hours to maybe 48. I'm not leaving them whole. I'm quartering them, so hopefully it will cut down the drying time. If you want to do a plum, from what I read, whole, you have to go ahead and blanch the skin, and you don't pit them. You just put them in a dehydrator, and you'll have prunes. These will be prunes, too, but they'll be in um, quarters. So I'll come back to you when I get them all done. Okay, um, I want to show you, this is like 30 hours of dehydrating my plums. Um, I just wanted to show you that they're done. They snap. And so now I will have plums for the winter time and I'll be able to make some jam with them. And they taste like candy. They're sweet and tart. They're really good. Thanks.